Hey guys, Mike here with Gadget Axe, and today's video is for all you students out there, whether you're in college or high school. Most of the time when you write a paper or a report, you'll need to end it with a bibliography or a works cited page where you cite all the publications that you refer to in your research. So you have to get all the information about the book, like the author name or names, if there's more than one, um, the publisher name, where the publisher is located, and all that jazz. Then you have to format it properly, make sure it's in the right order, with the correct punctuation. And to top it off, there are different formats for citations. There's MLA, APA, and Chicago are the three main ones. And you may have different teachers requesting different formats, which can complicate your homework. But we can simplify this process with the help of our Android phone. The app we'll be using today is called EasyBib, which lets you scan a book's barcode with your camera, then checks its database and creates a citation for you. I've already got it on my device, but you can find the link to it in the full article linked in the description below. So let's go ahead and open it up. And from here, you'll be able to scan the barcode for whatever book you need a bibliography for. Just make sure to get the barcode in this small box in the middle. So it should take just a few seconds and you've got your bibliography all set up for you. Um, you can toggle between formats here, it's MLA, APA, and Chicago. And you can send it to yourself via email. Um, just make sure it's uh, checked. You can toggle it just by tapping on it. Go to email citations at the bottom. And from here you can select your email app. Uh, you've got the email option, Gmail, or if you have an app like Pushbullet, then you can use that to get it onto your desktop or wherever you're writing your paper. So that's it for this video. Give the app a try and let us know what you think in the comments below. And please don't forget to like this video, subscribe for more, and check out the full article over at Gadget Hacks. Thanks for watching.